everybody. Um, the new year is about to come, but before it comes, let's talk about 2020. 2020 has taught me a lot of things. It's had its ups, it's had its downs, it's had its accomplishments, it's had its goals. But with all of that, I can honestly say 2020 has taught me how to humble myself, um, to see people's true colors, you know, knowing who to surround yourself with in order to make you better and knowing who is in your circle that is not for you and knowing the difference between the two characteristics. Also, it has taught me to be more independent as a young lady, doing things on my own, um, putting my goals on the number one thing that I have to do, accomplishing them. Um, also, with 2020, it has taught me to trust God. And by saying that, meaning like not worrying about the next day, not worrying about tomorrow, um, because God will supply all of your needs. Like when it comes to school, when it comes to finances, or when it comes to me wanting to do music and, you know, having the proper tools and finances for that, God always comes and makes a way. And so with 2020 wrapping, I pray that 2021 becomes a successful year for me. has been an interesting weird year i've learned a lot about myself that i did not realize sometimes you gotta have somebody to tell you hey yo like you're acting this way and if it's multiple constant people telling you that there's something that you have to change within yourself in order to prosper sometimes and move forward uh, i've learned to be more patient kind and understanding about people's feelings and mixed emotions and things like that and another thing that 2020 has taught me is that i'm in my bible more i feel like that i can hear and see God more clear and you know I'm a young adult I'm 21 I make mistakes all the time but that doesn't mean God still doesn't love me you know like I I go through trials and tribulations every day it like everyone does nobody's perfect I'm not I'm not perfect at all another thing that 2020 has taught me is just go for my goals like that don't wait be like flash in the movies and just go for it don't wait because I used to be that person that's like no I'm gonna just just wait it out but i'm no i'm not doing that anymore especially in 2021 it's a new year new me so overall that's what 2020 has taught me um i'm not worried about you know school i'm not as anxious as i was about school like i usually am because my education is important to me um so the things that i stick by and i'm going to stick by as in 2021 and as well is that nobody can make you happy unless you're happy with yourself first and when you start thinking negative thoughts it's not a good thing so catch yourself when you start thinking about negative thoughts and like when they start blooming out of nowhere because once you do that you're anxious your anxiety starts kicking in because i used to be like that and I told myself, I'm not going to be like that anymore. Like my whole family knows how I get when it comes to certain situations. And I'm glad that God has led, led me in the right direction for that. And so God has set in stone some things in my goals in life that is set in stone in 2021. So I'm happy to see what 2021 brings me. So if you hate me now, make sure you hate me more in 2021 because I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. But yeah, other than that. 2020 has taught me a lot about myself and I'm glad that I can make those changes in my heart and being humble as well. <laughs> This year has taught me a lot about taking care of myself and loving myself more and 
Um, even though this year has been pretty rough for a lot of us due to a lot of losses and stuff, I still made it through and we're gonna make it to 2021. This year, my main focus was organization. Um, but I kind of slacked on that a little bit. But I, I was still, I'm still doing good in my organizing, I think. Um, but I think I can do better next year. So that's what I'm going to go for.